This is the Bodhis Void, also known as the Great Nothing. It's a large empty space in the universe, and while the universe is generally pretty empty, the Bodhis Void shows a new caliber to it. It stretches 330 million light years. That's enough to fit our home galaxy, the Milky Way, in it, and that about 2000 times. So, even with the speed of light, you would still need over 300 million years to cross it. It was discovered in 1981, and that almost by accident, when a team of astronomers led by Robert Kirchner were mapping the positions of galaxies in 3D, they noticed something strange. There was a massive stretch of space with almost nothing in it. Inside this great nothing, only about 60 galaxies have been found. The problem is that based on its massive size, there should be tens of thousands of galaxies. Edward Hubble discovered the Andromeda Galaxy in 1924. This was the first time we discovered anything outside the Milky Way. If we were in the Botis Void, we wouldn't have known about anything outside the Milky Way until the 1960s. So yeah, the few galaxies in the void are cosmic loners. But how does something like this even happen? To understand that, we have to go back to the early universe. Just after the Big Bang, space was not smooth. It had tiny ripples, some spots were a bit denser, some less. Over billions of years, gravity pulled the denser areas together, forming stars and galaxies. Naturally, they had left under dense spots, and these, these became voids. Regions where matter drained away, leaving behind nearly empty bubbles of space. And that's what the Botis Void is, a left behind bubble of space. It's part of something called the Cosmic Web, a vast structure of filaments containing galaxies arranged like threads of a spider web, and giant voids in between. The Botis Void is incredibly valuable to science. By studying these mega voids, we learn how galaxies form and gravity behaves. It also helps in knowing how dark energy works. So, even though the Botis Void is kinda scary and crazy big, it's a natural phenomenon in the universe. So, until next time.